it's up to you. Choose, uh, choose one that you think is, is most difficult. All right, let's see here. We got uh, international dinner is pretty tough. I don't even know what they are. We've got the dressing a plate. Ooh, dressing a plate was tough. Supper. Let's do dressing a plate. Okay. Hold on a second. Dressing a plate. Make sure the size is good. Okay. Share screen. Yeah, this is good. This has got all types of different pronunciation uh, problems. So Edelson, let me get rid of my picture and uh, go for it. Go for it. Okay. Ready for the most exciting part? <clears throat> That's to dress the plate. Get your salad into almost like a rose at the top of your plate. Gently zest over the salad the fragrance of your lemon. Get your remoulade and spoon it at 6 o'clock and then run a spoon through it so it looks like a beautiful smear on the plate. Gently lift your crab cakes out of the frying pan and place them on the plate over the remoulade and then we are going to finish it with a little drizzle of fresh lemon juice. Finally, I'd like the plate absolutely spotless. Are you with me? That was really good, really great job. Uh, I'm going to be very picky on several things. Uh, let's go back. Dress the plate. Dress the plate. Dress the plate. So I need to hear more S. Dress the. Okay. Yeah, that's very tough. Yes. Dress the plate. So let's just focus on the S. Dress. Dress. Okay, that's perfect. Dress. So I want you to keep that long S and then watch carefully. I'm going to transition. Can you see me? Yeah. Okay, watch. Dress the. Dress the. Good. It's too fast. Slow down. Dress the. Dress the. Good. That was sounded much better. That's to dress the plate. That's to dress the plate. Your S is way too short. That's to dress the plate. That's to dress the plate. Yes, that sounded much better. Don't, the, the, remember, the S is the strong sound and the TH is the weak sound, so make that S absolutely clear, okay? That's to dress the plate. Great job. Like a rose at the top. Like a rose at the top. Good. At the, oh, again, it's the TH, like a rose at the top. Like a rose at the top. Good. And now I, you're missing the T. I do want to hear the stop sound. It's not easy, Edelson. At, at the, at the. At the. So we stop at, and then the tongue at. slides down to the TH. At the. At the. Good. At the top. At the top. Good. Uh, like a rose at the top. Like a rose at the top. Good. A little more stop. I still want to hear even more of that stop. So, Edelson, I can, we can see right now a lot of S-T-H, T-T-H transition might be your biggest problem. Um, so we want to focus on that in the future. It looks like here too. Uh, uh, zest over the salad, the fragrance. Zest over the salad, the fragrance. Sounds pretty good. Get the S here. Zest over the salad. Zest over the salad. The salad. Salad. Salad, the fragrance. Salad, the fragrance. Good. One more time. Salad, the fragrance. Salad, the fragrance. Very good. That was nice. Yeah, DTH sounded good. Uh, careful with your R, L, and also the O here. It's actually a schwa. Your lemon. Your lemon. Of your lemon. Perfect. So it looks like a beautiful smear. So it looks like a beautiful smear. You left out the S. Make sure you get that. So it looks like a beautiful smear. So it looks like a 
A beautiful smear. Good. A beautiful smear. So it looks like a beautiful smear. Good. Very good. Keep it smooth. Gently lift your crab cakes out. Gently lift your crab cakes out. Very nice. And I, I heard more of an N sound. I want that M to be clean. Place them on the plate. Place them on the plate. Good. Let's keep it a little more clean. Place them on the plate. Place them on the plate. I liked it. And one more time, fresh lemon juice. Fresh lemon juice. Yeah, great job, Edelson. What kind of chores are you going to be doing? I need to clean the uh, two bathrooms <laughs> and sweep and mopping the, the, the whole apartment, the entire apartment. <laughs> Your wife is very happy. <laughs> I need to do that because uh, she works outside and I need to do that. <laughs> You're a good husband. And a great student. Any questions, Edelson? No, no, it's clear. Thank you so much for your support. And I need to practice this S and T8 South, T8 transitions. Yes, I need to transition. I always do my best to improve. Excellent. I know you do. You really do a super job. Thanks, Edelson. Thank you. Have a nice weekend, Coach Shane. Thank you, you so much. Yep. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right. Uh, let me see here. No, 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 no. Adelson, you can keep us playing in the background. That's fine. Uh, we got a bunch of people here. Welcome, everybody. Uh, we got Andre, Gustavo, Jay, Margot, Marta, Mark, Paolo. Welcome, everybody. Who wants to go next? Nobody. It's Gustavo, you're next. What do you want to do, Gustavo? Uh, the same one. The same one, you bet. Let me uh, get rid of all the marks here, and I'll get rid of my face here. Gustavo, go for it. Okay. Ready for the most exciting part? That's to dress the plate. Get your salad to almost like a rose at the top of your plate. Gently sets over the salad the fragrance of your lemon. Get your remorat and spoon in a six o'clock and then run your spoon through it so it looks like a beautiful smear on the plate. Gently lift your crab case out of the frying pan and place them on the plate over the remorat. And then we're going to finish it with a little drizzle of fresh lemon juice. Finally, I like to play absolutely spotless. Are you with me? Great job. Very, very nice. Uh, I'm going to get you on lots of little things again here. Nothing too serious. Uh, and everybody, again, slow down. Uh, I know you, you saw the video, the lesson video, so you want to go faster. But you can still go slow. Make sure you get this ec exciting. Exciting. Ready for the most exciting part? Ready for the most exciting part? That's to dress the plate. That's to dress the plate. Good. Now you're doing the. Remember, I, I mm. do not like the. Get rid of the the. Yeah. Make it a schwa. The, the, the plate. Yeah. Okay. The plate. Yes. That's to dress the plate. That's to dress the plate. Great job. Salad. Salad. Not, not as he make it an S. And remember, in Spanish, es spotless, es salad, es spoon. Mm -hmm. But in English, no eh, salad. Salad. Get your salad. Get your salad. Good. Again, get your, we can say your, you can say your, let's say your. Get mm -hmm. your salad. Get your salad. Good. Gently. Gently. Zest. Zed. So, if we look here, just look at the look at my face here. Je, 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 and here, ze, ze, za, za. So, 
the sound, the vowel sound that we want is like, uh, is the, is the uh, eh, like in uh, uh, Fred or said, Fred, said. Fred, said. Je, ze. Je, je, ze. You're, cha you're changing your vowels. So listen again. Listen to yourself. Listen to yourself. Fred, z I'm sorry. Fred, said. And let's let's do this. Let's. There's not a word, but we're gonna do it anyway. Jed, Zed. Let's do that. Fred, said. Jed, Zed. Mm, okay. Fred, Zed, Jed, Zed. That's pretty good. Uh, your S sounded more like a Z. Let's do it one more time. Fred, said, Jed, Zed. Fred, said, Jed, Zed. That was really good. Again, salad. 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 A apple, happy. Ah, salad. Yes, yes. Salad. Apple. Apple, happy, salad. Apple, happy, salad. Good, 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 good. Your lemon. Your lemon. Good. Spoon it at six, sorry, spoon it at six o'clock. Mm. Spoon it at six o'clock. Spoon, no, spoon. Spoon. Looks like. Spoon it at six ah, okay. Looks like. Yes, good job. Again, gently. Gently. Perfect. Gently lift your crab cakes out. Gently lift your crab cakes out. Your, your, get that R. Your, your crab okay. cakes out. Your crab cakes out. Out of the frying pan. Out of the frying pan. Perfect. Finish it with a little drizzle. Finish it with a little drizzle. Perfect. Drizzle. Drizzle. Fresh lemon juice. Fresh lemon juice. Even more. Gently juice. Juice. Let's go back here. Gently juice. Gently juice. Perfect. Spotless. Spotless. S spotless. S spotless. No, <laughs> no S. <laughs> Spot spotless. Great, very good, very good, very good. Uh, so your G Z S pronunciation, we can do a little work there, and short A's. Those are ones that I really want you to get, and never S spoon, S uh, S spotless, S salad. Okay. Okay, thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Great job. Who's my next victim? Mario Gorzata, what would you like to do? Uh-oh. Let's do a quick mic check. My, uh, of the people remaining, I, I cannot hear you, Mario Gorzata. No? Nope. Yep, I can, okay. Yeah, I can okay. hear you now. Okay, perfect, perfect, sorry. Uh, I would like to do the same one because I have missed this class, so I have never done it before. Well, if you if you missed it, then you're gonna have lots of problems. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I hear a so dog. I, really in the I, hear, I hear a dog in the background. Oh, it's not mine. I don't know why it's so. Um, I know that people tell me that it it's really hard. Uh, I mean, it's very clear to hear the dog outside, but it's not my dog. <laughs> <laughs> you can adopt him and tell him to My dog him. is barkless, actually. She never barks. That's good. That's a special yeah, dog. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Okay, let's start. Let's do it. Go for it. Okay. Ready for the most exciting part? That's to dress the plate. Get your salad into almost like a rose at the top of your plate. Gently zest over the salad the fragrance of your lemon. 
get your lamellet and spoon it at 6 o'clock and then run your spoon through it so it looks like a beautiful smear on the, the plate. Gently leave your crab cakes out of a frying pan and place them on the plate over the remoulade. And then you are going to finish it with a little, little drizzle of fresh lemon juice. Finally, I like the plate absolutely spotless. Are you with me? Yeah, great job. Very, very nicely. Once again, uh, to be honest, too fast. <laughs> but it's very nice. You did a nice job. Let's okay. uh, hit the green parts here. Uh, mm -hmm. Ready for the most exciting part? Ready for the most exciting part? So I need to hear that TH. Further, yeah. further. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ready for the most exciting part? And it's not easy. I'm hearing a ther, but I want further. Let's go real slow. Further. Further. Good. Again. Ready for the what? most exciting part? Just stick with me. Stick with me. Further. Mm -hmm. Further. More R. Further. Further. Good. Further. Further. Good. Ready for the? Ready for that. You changed to four. That's okay. Ready for the surprise? Ready for the surprise? Now, now you change to a the. Careful with the the. Ready for the? Ready for the of further. <laughs> Ready for the? Good. R one more time. Ready for the? Ready for the? Ready for the dessert? Ready for the dessert. Yeah, you're having a hard time. So this is something I want you to watch in the future, okay? Okay. Okay. So the, it's passing from R to the again. Yes, it's mm -hmm. the RTH transition. That's right. Mm -hmm. I'll be listening to your other transitions too. Let's go to this word, part. Part. Yes, good. Dress the plate. Dress the plate. Yeah, that was good. Your STH, no problem. One more time. Dress the plate. Dress the plate. Yep, good. Like a rose at the top. Like a rose at the top. Keep more K. Like a, like a rose at the top. Like a rose at the top. Of your plate. Of your plate. Great, very good. How do you say this word? Salad. Good. And this word? Uh, then one, I have a question actually because uh, you s I don't know how do you say it, but it's fragrance or fra right. fragrance. Fragrance. So what you said the, the first time, the first time sounded best. So sa and uh, salad is a short A, fray is a long A. And this is a schwa, so salad fragrance, salad fragrance, salad fragrance. Try that. Sa salad fragrance, salad fragrance. Perfect. Okay. So it's not fragrance, it's fragrance. Yeah, it's a fray. It's, it's actually. A fray. Yes, that's right. Fragrance. Fra salad fragrance. Mm -hmm. Yep. And make it quick. Fragrance, especially the second syllable. Fragrance. Fragrance. Very Fragrance. good, very good. Six o'clock. Six o'clock. Yeah, and just like that, like, uh, make sure you keep that K sound in here. Six o'clock. Six o'clock. Great. Six o'clock. Looks like. Looks like. Yep, keep the S there. People tend to get rid of the S. I don't know why. Uh, this is your uh, short I. So we got the E and the I. Make sure you keep that I. Gently lift your crab cakes. Gently lift your crab cakes. Finish it with a little drizzle. Finish it with a little, no, little drizzle. Yeah, a little. Finish, finish it with a little drizzle. There you go, there you go. So all of these, I really like this sequence here. All of these have a, a short I with it. Lift, finish uh, it with little drizzle. It's, it's a really a good practice for the short I. Um, so I, let me hear it one more time. 
Lift, finish it with a little drizzle. Lift, finish it with a little drizzle. drizzle. Ah, little is the weakest. Again. <laughs> finish, no, finish it with a little drizzle. Perfect. Relax. Try again. <laughs> finish, <laughs> no. Finish it with a little drizzle. There, it sounded much more natural. Very good. How do you say this word? We are. Good. And make it a contraction? Oh, we are? <laughs> no, yes. I don't know. No, that's exactly yeah. right. It's we are and a contraction, we're, and the Americans are probably going to say were, were. Okay? Mm-hmm. So, were. So for you, actually, I prefer that you say we're, but if you say were, that's okay. So do this. And then we're going to. And then we are going to. More TH. And then we're going to. Mm -hmm. And then we are going to. And now let's make it more like an American. And then we're going to. And then we are going to. Were. And then we're going to. And then we're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> See, now this is um, important. Yeah, that's okay. This is important. If the student is going to say going to, then you should say we're. If you're going to say were, then you should say gonna. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so if it's contracted, it's contrasted like uh, absolutely contracted. Yeah, if you're going to make it American okay. reduction, absolutely everything. Okay. And let's do this one too. I'd like the plate absolutely spotless. I like the plate absolutely spotless. Absolutely. Absolutely. Happy. Happy. Oh, okay. So, mm. ab absolutely. Yes, yes. Salad. Absolutely. Happy, happy salad. Ab absolutely. And, and there was, a, and is the same like in a pan, pan and with um, frying pan. So it's the same as. Uh, Yes, pan. frying pan. Yes. Happy salad, absolutely pan. Okay. Yep. That was my question, actually. Very good, very good. Yeah. Okay. Having those patterns, having those words in your head is really going to help you get that sound. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Great job, Margozata. Okay. okay. Thank you. You bet. Who's my next victim? Knock. Hi, Knock. Hello. Hello. Knock Hi. after Knock will be Jay. Knock, which one do you want to do? Yeah, this lesson. This one. Everybody wants this one. Yeah. Everybody wants to dress the plate. All right, hold on a second. Let me get my mug out of here. All right, Nak, go for it. Okay. Ready for the most exciting part? That's to dress the plate. Get your salad into almost like a rose at the top of your plate. Gently zest over your salad, the fragrance of your lemon. Get your remoulade and spoon it at 6 o'clock. And then run your spoon through it, so it looks like a beautiful smear on the plate. Gently lift your crab cakes out of the frying pan and place them on the plate over the remoulade. Then we're going to finish it with a little drizzle of fresh lemon juice. Finally. I like the plate absolutely spotless. Are you with me? That was really great, Doc. I'm very impressed. Uh, I have lots of Vietnamese students, so I'm 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 quite. I I know that lots of Vietnamese students have many problems uh, with pronunciation. You did a really super job. Okay, thank you. Come on. Ready. Ready. Ready for the? Ready for the? Good. That's to dress the plate. That's to dress the plate. So I need to hear that S one more time. That's to dress the plate. That's to dress the plate. Very good. At the top. At the top. 
So I want to hear more TH at the top. At the top. Good. Plate. Plate. Yeah, make, make that A a little bit longer. Plate. Plate. At the top of your plate. At the top of your plate. Good. One more time. Watch me. At the top of your plate. At the top of your plate. 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 At the top of your plate. At the top of your plate. Much better. Keep that A really strong, okay? Okay. Gently zest over. Gently zest over. Zest over. Zest over. Good. Keep that S. Zest over. Zest over. Good. One more time. Gently zest over. Gently zest over. Good, good. So try and keep the T. You're changing this to a D. Nah, that's okay, but try and keep the T. And once again, um, imagine you have your food here and a lemon and you're and you're gonna zest. Gently zest over. Okay. Gently zest over. <laughs> One more time. Gently zest over. Gently zest over. That was your best. One more. Gently zest over. Very good. It's getting better. It's getting better. Very good. Okay, thanks. I got a couple of O's here, um, and your pronunciation is almost perfect, but I want a little more. Uh, six o'clock. Six o'clock. Six. -a. Make this a schwa. Six. -a. Six o'clock. Okay. Six o'clock. On the plate. On the plate. On the plate. On the plate. Good. Plate. I get. I get you on that plate again. Plate. Plate. Cakes. Cake. Uh, long a. Cakes. Cakes. Place. Plates. Plate. Plate. Good. All the same sound. So make sure your A vowel is a little bit longer. Let's go here. Okay. And then we're going to. And then we're going to. Good. Let's get that. Try and get a stop D and a TH. And then. And then. Perfect. And then. And. Then great. Now let's make it faster. That was perfect. Now let's make it faster. And then and then it sounds really good. How do you say this word? Little. Little. Yeah. So let's remember this one. Finish it with a little drizzle. Finish it with a little drizzle. So, I don't know why, but this is the word that's giving everybody problems. Everything else was perfect. Finish it with a little drizzle. No, no, no. Finish it with a little drizzle. Okay, I'll try. Finish it with a little drizzle. Better. Again. Finish it with a little drizzle. Let's do this. A little leader. Little leader. Good. Little leader. Little leader. Good. Finish it with a little drizzle. Finish it with a little drizzle. Once more. Uh, finish it with a little drizzle. Good. Keep practicing that too, okay? Okay, okay. But I have a question. Question. Let's do uh, one more, and then I'll. Me? Let's do one more, and then I'll take your question, okay? Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'd like. I'd like. 
Yes, and again, it's the stop D and then the next consonant. Make sure, do your best to have the stop D. Again, the American, when they're speaking, probably they will cancel the D. But for you, I, I do want you to try and keep it. If you can keep it, later on your cancellation will be perfect, okay? Okay, yeah, thanks. Okay, go ahead with your question, Mark. Um, the T, I would like to know the, the ending of um, the position of your tongue when you end the T sound. Because, uh, for example, exciting part, part or part. Right. So P-A-R-T, that word, right? Yeah, exactly. All right. So inside, these are your upper teeth and these are your lower teeth. Exciting part. So we, when we do the R sound, the tongue is pointing here. This is the R. And then when we go to the T, we just need to stop it. And the T, the tongue tends to stop a little bit high after the R. Because the, the R, the tongue is already up, part. And then the tongue actually kind of comes in a little bit high to stop. Okay? Now, if we're going to finish it, part. If we're going to make a T sound, we want to actually bring the tongue down a little bit more to here. This is, at this point, it's going to be easier to make a t, t. If you're up too high, t, t, it sounds like t, t. And that's not what we want. We want t. t. So be, if we're going to make a stop t, part, a little bit high, green, part, part, part. If we want to finish t, a little bit down, the pink, part, part, part. Okay? Okay, got it. Okay, thanks. And I'll just add one thing. If you're going to make a flat T, also, you're going to be at the pink area. So for a, a finish T or a flap T, you're going to be in the pink, and the green is going to be for that stop T, for the stop, for the stop T. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. Any other questions? Okay, thank you. You bet. Thank you. Absolutely. Good job, Nak. What time is it? Where are you? Where are you? Uh, now I'm living in Italy. In Italy. Yeah. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. <laughs> Grazie. <laughs> yeah. What What do you do in Italy? Uh, I'm studying. What do you study? I'm studying computer science. That's easy. Uh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> in English or in Italian? Uh, in English, of course. Wow. Yeah. yeah because I can't speak Italian. No. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. All right, who's next? Jay is next. Jay. Jay, which one would you like to do? Uh. 120, please. 120. Absolutely. You know what? I need to download 120 from my, from Box, just like you guys. I got to download. Boom, 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 boom. Hold up. There we go. Edit mode. Enable editing. Yes. Change the screen. Make the file bigger. Coming clean. All right, Jay. Let's hear your confession. Go for it. I've, I've got to come clean about something. Something I say I enjoy. I actually can't stand because of my job. I'm a performing arts professor specializing in the guitar. People think I really enjoy guitar music in any genre. To be honest, I don't. 
I especially despise it when people try to mix up the guitar with classical music, a ballet with a six string. Get out of your my get out of my space. But alas, what can I do? The show it must go on. It's all about the art, right? <laughs> oh, do this again one more time. This section. What can I do? <laughs> <laughs> that was beautiful. That's great. Uh, I liked it. What can I do? <laughs> Very good. So I'll get you a little bit on pronunciation and a little bit on intonation. First of all, something I say I enjoy. Something I say I enjoy. Good. So what I want a little more linking. Let's go a uh, thing. Thing I. Thing I. Good. Something I say I enjoy. Something I say I enjoy. Now let's get the stress. Something I say I enjoy. Something I say I enjoy. I actually can't stand. I actually can't stand. Good expression. Can't stand. Can't stand. Despise. Despise. Hate. Hate. Get out of my space. Get out of my space. Be angry. Yes, I'm angry. <laughs> <laughs> good, good. <laughs> now, remember, this continues here. So it's a, it's so now we're done. We're this sentence is completely done. Now we go to our next sentence. And the next sentence is actually because of my job, people think I really oops, I really enjoy guitar music in any genre. That's a sentence. So let's do that. Because of my job, people think I really enjoy guitar music in any genre. Because of my job, people think I really enjoy guitar music in any genre. Good. Now, what is this guy's job? We don't know his job. So, again, because of my job, I'm a performing arts professor specializing in the guitar. People think I really enjoy guitar music in any genre. Because of my job, I'm a performing art professor specializing in the guitar. People think I really enjoy guitar music in any genre. Good. So if you watched me, you can see like ba 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 da 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 anecdote, anecdote, extra information, and back to the sentence, back to the sentence. So you can see that up, down, okay? Uh -huh. Performing. 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 Performing arts professor. Performing arts professor. Good. Pro. Professor. Pro professor. Guitar. Guitar. Do you play any instrument? No. Are you a good singer? No, I'm bad. What? Are you a dancer? No, no. <laughs> so no art for you. Yes, no art for me. No, no art for me. Good, very good. Me too. Oh, I'm pretty bad. Genre. Genre. What genre of music do you like? Mm, country. In 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 US, I like country. I think it's really easy. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, so American country music. Right? Yes. Yeah, that's my favorite genre too. You you picked a good a good genre. I guess guys that cannot sing and cannot play music and cannot dance, we like country music, right? Yeah, but but in my country I don't like country music. Uh so Thai country music is different? Yes. Um, uh, in my generation they don't like country music. Yeah, yeah. I I understand. Okay, let's go back down here. Um, so your negatives, your can't was okay. Um, I would actually want your can't to be a little bit stronger. Let's do it again. 
I actually can't stand. I actually can stand. Good, good. And here too, to be honest, I don't. To be honest, I don't. Good. I especially despise it. I especially despise it. I, uh, get your linking. I especially despise it. I, uh, I especially despise it. Good, stronger. I especially despise it. I especially despise it. Mash up. Mash up. People try to mash up the guitar. People try to mash up the guitar. Get out of my space! Get out of my space. Ah! That's the idea. Very good, Jay. Questions? I, and once again, I just love that your intonation was perfect. What can I do? <laughs> perfect. Questions? No. You did a super Thank job. You. Very, very good. Good job, Jay. Always good to hear from you. All right, who do I got? I got Andre, Elena, Paolo, Steve. I think those are my final four victims. Who wants to go next? They all fell asleep. Frere Jacques, Frere Jacques, dormez-vous. Ah, Steve. <laughs> you wake me up. <laughs> <laughs> what time is it, Steve? No, it's, it's, it's pretty late already. It's 7 here, it's about 8 o'clock. Yeah, it's, it's 7.44, right? Yeah, it's one hour difference, right? Yeah. It's early for you. Yes, it's, 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 that's normal. The time on the weekdays, I, work, uh, I normally I wake up about 6 because I have to drive my daughter to school, then go back, go to her work. You take your daughter to school at six? Uh, no, we we six get up and dress and then prepare lunch, then drive her to school uh, about seven, twelve, seven ten, and then go back to work about eight o'clock. My goodness. Uh, does your wife work? Yeah, she works too, and she she she. Uh, she 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 drove my son to school. <laughs> we have two students. So so yeah. you're you're the bus driver for your daughter, and your wife is the bus driver for your son. Yeah, and uh, on the weekends, my son plays hockey, so I also a uh, a uh, uh, driver to my son too. <laughs> hockey parents. <laughs> is he a, is he a good hockey player? Yeah, he likes, and also, yeah, he played defense, so he's doing pretty good. How how old is he? He's 11. So does he have all of his teeth? <laughs> we try to protect. <laughs> yeah, so far, it's still, at, at this stage, it's now they still allow, they still don't allow a body check yet, so Not he's yet. safe. Yeah. Is, is he big? Is he big? He's not a big, but he's fast. He's oh. he's kind of uh, he's, uh, small, but it's, you know most of Chinese, uh, you know, like he he's more like an Indian. Uh, but I always call he's a banana banana guy. He's uh, he's he's yellow, but inside he's white. <laughs> but but he he <laughs> he's a figure like Chinese, right? He looks yeah. Chinese and it's it's very small but very fast. That's good. He'll That's, be he'll be another Wayne Gretzky. <laughs> I'm not excited that way, but uh, but he likes that. That's the most important thing. That's right. That's right. All right, Steve. Which one do you want to do? I would do one nineteen. One nineteen. Summarizing a movie. Oh, yeah. All right. Enable editing. Yes. All right, Steve, go for it. Marlin, a clownfish, is a widower who has only his son Nemo left after a predator attack took his beloved wife. Years later, 
On Nemo's first day of school, the boy is captured by a scuba diver and ends up living temporarily in a dentist's office fish tank. Marlin and his new absent-minded friend Dory set off across the ocean to find Nemo and bring him home. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates scheme on how to get out of the tank before he becomes the dentist's niece's new pet. Time takes quickly in this adventure, rescue at adventure. That was really good. Uh, you And once again, uh, the ending, you can tell you got warmed up. And at the end, it got really, really uh, very, very nice. Very nice. Good job. Thank uh, you. Let's be careful with the E and the I. So, uh, Marlin. Marlin. Marvin. Marlin. Yeah. Yes, exactly right. So, the, there's a woman's name. Marlene, and then there's a man's name, Marlin. So Marlene, Marlin. Marlene, Marlin, Marlin. Again, Marlene, Marlin. Marlene, Marlin. Good, and let's put it together. Marlene, Marlin. Marlene, Marlin. Great, excellent, excellent. A widower. A widower. Yeah. Uh, Marlin, a widower. Marlin, Marlin, a widower. Perfect. Uh, only his son Nemo left after a predator attack. Only his son Nemo left after a predator attack. Good. So, after an attack, these should sound the same. After a predator attack. After after a predator attack. Good. Okay. So one more time. After a predator attack. After a predator attack. Good. So now I want a little more linking, and I'm looking at your RA here and also your RA here. Both of these a little more linking. After a. After after a predator attack. Let's just go there. After a. After, after, after. Good. Predator. 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 Good. So we got ra. Both of them are ra. After a predator attack. After a predator attack. Bingo. Canadian. Total Edmonton. Maybe even a little Toronto. Try again. <laughs> After a predator attack. Much better. His beloved wife. His beloved wife. His beloved wife. Americans are, I think Canada too. Most people say beloved. Beloved. His beloved wife. His beloved wife. Yep, it's a special pronunciation. Some people do say beloved. Beloved. But many people say beloved. I don't know what they would say in Canada, actually. I, I used to do a lot to my wife, anyway. <laughs> That's why you have two children. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Scuba diver. Scuba diver. I'm guessing you would like scuba diving. Yeah, how do you know it? Yeah, I, I went to Cuba, but uh, the, the sky was not uh, the same. See, at that day, the weather was not good, so I didn't have a chance to try. But I tried uh, something you can flow on the surface, and so, yeah, I, I did it two times when I was in Cuba. Yep, uh, it's something I would like to try, too. Yeah, it's, 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 it's great. Yeah, some of my friends, they do that. Also, my colleague, actually, two or three, no, now they, 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 they are going to uh, Vietnam and... Uh, Malaysia, and they're going to try scuba diving there. Sounds great. Temporarily. Temporarily. Yeah, it's a tough one. Keep that air rare. Temporarily. 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 Rare. Rare. Temporarily. Yes, that was good. And get that Lee a little more. Temporarily. Temporarily. Rarely. Rarely. Temporarily. Good. I'm hearing a little touching. 
We don't want touching. Rarely. Rarely. Yes, that's actually right. It might be tough. Temporarily. Temporarily. <laughs> good, good. One more time. Temporarily. 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 Excellent. Very good. Very good. It's a tough word. Absent-minded friend Dory. Absent-minded friend Dory. Good. Across the ocean. Across the ocean. One more time. Acro Jack, mute your mic, please. I'll mute it. I can mute mics okay. if I don't like to. Uh, one more time. Across the ocean. Across the ocean. Good. Faster. Across the ocean. Across the ocean. The ocean. Uh, you're in Canada, so the, the ocean is okay. Across the <laughs> ocean. Across the ocean. Good. Adventure. 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 Good. Don't let any pause. So you touch the D, ad, and then as you touch the D, the V should be ready. Adventure. 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 Great job. Super job. Any questions? Uh, no, just uh, uh, the one of the words in 120. J, J E A R E. That's a French word, right? No, I'm talking the other, the other one. The one uh, what uh, oh, J just practiced. J E A R E. That's a French. Yes. Yeah, what, what, how to pronounce that? I find it's hard for me. Yeah, it's a ZH sound, Jean. So actually the sound is something like this. Uh, Jean, like in John, Jean, genre, 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 genre. Genre, genre. Some people say genre. Some people say Jean, uh, Jean, genre. Some people say genre. Genre, but genre is, I think, more French. So you'll hear both. So you'll hear both. Yeah, genre. Yes, that's that's the one I prefer. But try the other one too. Genre. Genre. Yeah. Genre. Oh, ask your yeah. ask your coworker what do they say? They and I'll, actually Canadian people should have a good pronunciation because they many of them speak French. Yeah, my one of my colleague actually he's from Quebec, and we are, we we pick off a lot, and yeah, he can speak. Uh, he, uh, but, but I think his his English is a second language. <laughs> his his video language is French. You know what? Okay. It's, yeah, it's funny. I have I have about six uh, students from Quebec. Really? I know. I'm surprised because um, it's Canada. And I, you know, they're all white Canadians, but they take my classes. I was surprised. Uh, yeah, actually, I'm not sure. Have you ever been in Quebec or uh, Quebec no, City? Uh, sure. They, some of the, uh, I think many of the people they don't speak English at all. Wow, I was surprised. But, uh, I, I had a conference conference uh, two years ago at Quebec City. And in some store you go there, they just can't speak English. And so we have to use the sign language. Oh. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Great yeah. job. Thank you very much, Steve. Thank you. Um, I'm noticing suddenly I got Prashant, Aruna, Hiba, and Jack just joined. And I'm guessing you guys uh, are either late or you didn't know, you don't know about the time change. So no problem. I will, uh, I will listen to everybody today, but please remember, actually, the clocks change for LA time, so you, uh, you're almost an hour late. So for me, that's no problem, but I worry for other ones. Jack, go ahead. Oh, sorry, I, I in the perf one twenty, uh, it 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 read uh, in that uh, assignment. It, it's uh, it's 
uh, 8 a.m. Chicago time. And now it's 9. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. It's, oops. It's 9 o'clock now. <laughs> Okay, sorry. No, that's okay. That's okay. This is a bad time of the year. The clocks change in America. And in Europe, they're going to change oh, in a couple weeks. Maybe some confusion. LA time and Chicago time. Well, anyway, yeah, yeah. Uh, I know. That's another problem of me. I'm, I'm in Chicago, but LA, that's, I apologize. So you guys did well, but try next time, try an hour earlier if possible. Uh, but I'll be here anyway. I'm, I'm, I'm not in any hurry. Okay. My next victim. Who's my next victim? Andre and then Elena. Andre, go ahead. Which one do you want to do? Let's find Nemo. Oh, boy. All right. Summarizing a movie. I actually like this movie. This is a movie I saw a long time ago but not in a theater, you know Coach Shane. Andre, go for it. Okay. Marlin, a clownfish, is a widower who has only his son Nemo left after a predator attack took his beloved wife. Years later, on Nemo's first day of school, the boy is captured by a scuba diver and ends up leaving temporarily in a dentist office's fish tank. Marlin and his new absent-minded friend Dory set off across the ocean to find Nemo and bring him home. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates scheme on how to get out of the tank before he becomes the dentist's niece's new pet. Time ticks quickly in this rescue adventure. Wow, really good. Really, really great. The speed was perfect. Excellent job. Widower. Widower. The widower likes vodka. The widower likes what? vodka. <laughs> <laughs> I'm teasing. One more time. Widower who? Widower who? Widower. Widower. The widow, widower who? Widower who? Dwinguet. Do you know Dwinguet? No. I'm going to give you a song to, to enjoy. You need it with uh, lyrics. Let me just verify. Hold on a second, guys. So I'm going to give you a, a song here. And after the lesson, I want you to uh, practice this song with all the W's. The W's are really, 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 really great. Okay? Yes. You're going to hate me, Andre. <laughs> Okay, let's move on here. Pre so let's do pr perfect pronunciation. Predator. Predator. Good. Predator. 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 Oh, that was really good. Really good. Uh, don't make the flap T too weak. Predator attack. Predator attack. Great job. Is it too or took? Took. Yep. So... After a predator attack, took his beloved wife. After a predator attack, took his beloved wife. Perfect. Don't cancel the D in minded. Absent-minded friend. Uh -huh. Absent-minded friend. Yeah, we keep that D and we actually bring it over. Minded. Minded. Are you absent-minded? Yes. No, you're not. <laughs> I know I, I know you a bit, and I assume you are not absent-minded. I love Dory. <laughs> She's great. 
<laughs> she's great. She's relaxing and frustrating. Yes, yes. So let's do that. Uh, set off across the ocean. Set off across the ocean. Good. And again, you said across. Keep uh, it to an uh, I, across. Mm -hmm. I got it. And Set now, off across. And now you should be friends with Steve because you should. You said the ocean. The ocean. Good. If you want to speak Canadian, hang out with Steve, okay? Okay. Time ticks quickly. Oh, it's my time ticks quickly. Time ticks quickly in this rescue adventure. Time ticks quickly in this rescue adventure. Muy perfecto. Any questions? Uh, I don't remember which perf. Uh, e -e -e. Uh, we are going to finish it with little drizzle. May I say this phrase? Yep. Let me uh, bring it up here. Them short I. Yeah, I know. You're fit. Yeah, this is a good one for you. Go for it. And then we're going to finish it with a little drizzle of fresh lemon juice. Excellent job. Great job. It sounded natural. Try one more time. And then we're going to finish it with a little drizzle of fresh lemon juice. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. You nailed it. Thank you. Thank Get to that W song, okay? I, I don't know how. <laughs> do, uh, do you see the chat room? Ah, uh, yes. Click on that link and hate me, okay? You made me uh, uh, a separate vi video, but I couldn't manage to master this sound, yes, yet. Yet, yet is the key. Yes. Great job, Andre. Thank you. All right, Elena, which one do you want to do? I want 118. 118 dressing the plates. Go for it. Oops, sorry. Did you memorize it? <laughs> <laughs> All right, there you go. Go for it. Ready for the most exciting part? That's to dress the plate. Get your salad into almost like a rose at the top of your plate. Gently zest over the salad the fragrance of your lemon. Get your ring lot and spoon it at 6 o'clock. And then run your spoon through it. So it looks like a beautiful smear on the plate. Gently lift your crab cakes out of the frying pan and place them on the plate over the ring lot. And then we are going to finish it with a little drizzle of fresh lemon juice. Finally, I like the plate absolutely spotless. Are you with me? Yeah, that was excellent. That was really excellent. And I think uh, the other students listening uh, will agree. That was really super. Uh, so I have to be real particular on a couple of things. Uh, let's, let me hear a, a, a cleaner and stronger. Get your salad. Get your salad. Get your, give me more R. Get your salad. Get your salad. Good. Let's go with a proper pronunciation. Get your salad. Get your salad. Very good, very good. I only got you on one the, the salad. The salad. Gently zest over the salad, the fragrance of your lemon. Gently zest over the salad the fragrance of your lemon. One more, please. Gently zest over the salad the gr uh, fragrance of your lemon. Great job. And your short I, long E, a little bit here. Gently lift your crab cakes. Gently lift your crab cakes. Yep. Uh, let's do this. All of this here. Gently lift your crab cakes out of the... To start over. You Gently said lift. lift your... said, sorry, you said lift, so I'm, I started you. Every time you make a mistake, I'm going to stop you. Go ahead. Gently lift your crab cakes out of the frying pan. 
and place them on the plate over and the rainbow. And finish it with a little drizzle. Uh, and finish it with a little drizzle. Good. One more. Gently lift your crab cakes out of the frying pan and finish it with a little drizzle. Excellent job. Yeah, really great. Uh, so the sometimes a lot of Russian students, Russian and Portuguese students especially, want to say the. So you did a good job. Just one problem. And the short I, uh, just one problem. You did a really, really nice job. Great. Thank you. Yeah, super job. Any questions? Um, my, what I worry about now more, it is what you always tell me that I sound like a robot. How it was today? You absolutely did not sound like a robot today. Uh, it sounded really good, and it sounded like you were the chef. Great. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. You did a super job. Thanks. Great. Yeah, uh, and that's a key thing. What Elena is talking about uh, is that sounding like a robot, trying to bring more of you into uh, the story. So that's why, so when you guys, I mean, come on, some of you are not a chef. So it's not going to be natural. Uh, some of you don't know the movie Finding Nemo, so it's not going to be natural. But we have different uh, lessons. So hopefully one of these lessons is kind of easy for you. And for the live hangout with me, pick that one and practice that one, and it, it's going to sound great. Guys, give me one second. Just one second, please. Uh, just All right, I am back. I didn't go far, as you could probably see. Uh, okay, so next now, who I'm gonna, gonna look? Hiba, let's do Hiba and then Prashant next. Hiba, can you hear me? Hello. Hello. Hello, can you understand? How are you? Very good. Welcome. Uh, first, uh, I'm sorry for being late. I will try to make it on time next uh, session. No problem at all. No problem. Very sorry. I'm very sorry. What I, the only thing I worry about is, let's say when I start, I only have three or four students, and then we finish early, and then people who come late missed everything. That's what I worry You're about. Right. You're right. Okay, Hiba, which one would you like to practice? A 119, please. You bet. Find the Nemo. Oh, boy. The... Uh, Movie summary, not an easy one. All right, let me get rid of my picture. All right, go for it, Hiba. Okay. Marlene, a clownfish, is a widower who has only his son Nemo left after a predator attack took his beloved wife. Years later, on Nemo's first day of school, uh, the boy is captured by a scuba diver and ends up living temporarily in a dentist office's fish tank. Uh, Marlin and his new absent-minded friend Dory set off across the, the ocean to find Nemo and bring him home. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates, uh, tank, tank mates scheme on how to get out of the tank before he becomes before he becomes uh, the dentist needs new bed. Time ticks quickly in this rescue adventure. That was really good. Great, great job. Very pleased. Um, and I especially like the speed. The speed was really good. It's nice and slow and concentrated, which is which is perfect. Thank you. Okay, so let's go slow here. Marlin. 
Marlin. Good. So your R sometimes has has some touching model Marlin. You don't want to touch Marlin. Marlin. Perfect. After. After. Good. That's a short A. So you were saying ah, uh, but we don't want to say ah. Uh, mm. We want to say ah. Uh, after. Uh, after. Great job. Predator. Predator. Good. Nemo left. Oh, let's say, uh, let's just do this. Let's do this section here. Nemo left after a predator attack. Nemo left after a predator attack. Good. Careful again. It's right here. Oops. Right here and here. I really want you to be careful with your R. Nemo left after a predator attack. Nemo left after a predator attack. Much better. After a... After a... Good. After a... After a predator attack. After a predator attack. Great job. First day. First day. Lots of students want to say fair, but don't say that. Say fur. First day. First day. Day. Ends up living. Ends up living. Absent minded. Absent minded. After. After. And bring. And bring. Good. Bring. Careful. Bring. Bring. Good job. The tongue doesn't touch. Great. And bring. And bring. Uh, across the ocean to find Nemo and bring him home. Across, across the ocean to find Nemo and bring and bring him home. Yes, one more time. Across the ocean to across find. <laughs> Oops. Across, across the ocean to find Nemo and bring and bring him home. Yes, very good. His tank mate scheme. His tank mate scheme. Good. Put the S's together. His tank mate scheme. His tank mate, uh, his tank mate scheme. Good job. It's a tough one. And this too, very difficult. Dentist's niece's new pet. Dentist Nieces, new pet. New pet. No pet. Dentist's niece's new pet. Dentist's niece's new pet. New pet. No pet. Good. Pet. Uh, do you have a, a tissue? If you go watch me, I'm gonna say B E T B E T. Bet 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 bet. And now I'm gonna say P E T P E T. Mm. Pet pet. Pet. So when you pet, do the P pet. sound, whoo, it really comes out. So new pet. New pet. Keep practicing the BP, okay? Pet. And one more. Time ticks quickly. Time ticks quickly. Excellent job. Very good job, Hiba. Thank you. Thank you, God. Any questions? No, thank you. Super job. Thank you. Next victim. Who's my next victim? Prashant. Uh, and yeah, was it? Yeah. Hi. How you doing, Prashant? Oh, I am. I'm pretty good. How about you? Fine. Long time Long meeting time. you. It's good to hear your voice. What do you want to do? Yeah. Yeah. This one one nine. All right, sir. Hold on a second. All right. Go for it, sir. Okay, sir, thank you. Marlon, a clownfish is a widower who has only his son Nemo left after a predator attack to his beloved wife. Years later, on Nemo's first day of school, the boy is captured by a scuba diver and ends up living, oh, and ends up living temporarily in a dentist's office's fish tank. Marlon and his nephew Oh, sorry, Marlin and his new absent-minded friend Dory set off across the ocean to find Nemo 
and bring him home. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates scheme on how to get out of the tank before he becomes the dentist's nurse's new pet. Time ticks quickly in this rescue adventure. Wow! Again, a really excellent job. Super, super job. Uh, so I have to look for problems pretty hard. I'm so impressed. People who have uh, stayed with me a long time um, have really improved uh, in every aspect. I'm really happy. So let's go up to the top here. Um, after a predator attack. After a predator attack. Yeah. Attack. Yes, exactly, exactly. One more time, please. After a predator attack. Great. And so now your after is perfect. Attack is perfect. I want to hear a little more of a ruh here. Predator attack. I want my tape tongue uh, surgery to like an American tongue <laughs> to have. <laughs> and so R is literally... Yeah, you know, killing me. Predator. Predator attack. Predator attack. Great. After a predator attack. After a predator attack. Super, it's perfect. Let's go here. Uh, by a scuba diver and ends up living. By a scuba diver and ends up living. Good, good. One more time. By a scuba diver. And ends up by living. Sorry, sorry. By a scuba diver and ends up living. Excellent, perfect. Let's do this right here. Uh, just this section. Absent-minded friend Dory. Okay. Absent-minded friend Dory. Now, I want you to listen to the the intonation here when I when I do this. Marlin okay. and his new absent-minded friend Dory set off. Okay. Marlin and his new absent uh, sorry, Marlin and his new absent minded friend Dory set off. Yes, there you go. So if you if, if everybody's watching, it's kinda like this. Marlin and his new absent minded friend Dory set off. It it kind of does that. Try that. Okay. Marlin and his new absent minded friend Dory set off. It's gonna be more like this, Prashant. And his new absent-minded friend Dory. It's gonna go. It's gonna be high and then come down a little bit. Try again. Uh, Marlin and his new absent-minded friend Dory. Keep it. Keep it separate. His new absent-minded friend. Sorry, right there. His new absent-minded friend Dory. Okay. His new absent-minded friend, Dory. Good. Now, give me the whole thing one more time up to set off. Okay. Marlin and his new absent-minded friend, Dory. Set off. Set off. Excellent. Job. Perfect. Becomes. Yeah, yeah. You said be, and I wanted more. B or b. Before he becomes. Okay. Before he becomes. Time ticks quickly. Time takes quickly. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Any questions, sir? No, so far so good. Yeah, you're doing Wonderful. great. Thank you. Super job. Thank you, Prashant. Thank you. All right, so I, I got, like I got uh, Paolo, Mahmoud, Jack, and Aruna, right? Yeah. Let's, I hope nobody else joins. Otherwise, I'll never get out of here. My goodness. So, Paolo, you're I next. I don't mind to be the last one. You're going to be the last one. I don't mind to be the last one. You don't want to? Let the guys work. No, I don't mind to be the last one. <laughs> you are last. Yeah. I'm Paolo, <laughs> Jack, Aruna. I'm sorry. Mahmoud, Jack, Aruna. Who is it going to be? And remember, you guys are <laughs> come early next time, LA time. Double check your internet, uh, and you'll realize that uh, for me right now, 
It's not 822. It is, uh, well, actually 927. My computer says 922. Jack Mockwood Aruna, are you sleeping? Jack, you're no. up. Jack and then Aruna. Jack, so this is your order. Jack, Aruna, Mahmoud, and Paolo. That's going to be the order today. Jack, which one would you like to do? Uh, finding Nemo. Finding Nemo. Did I'm so it? sorry. That's because uh, <laughs> when I searched search the internet, uh, I, the, the website shows me it's still the eight o'clock, but I <laughs> I switch another website. It's nine, so <laughs> I'm so sorry. No, that's no problem. I'm just I'm happy that I was here because I because I'm sure sometimes students join a hangout and there is no hangout. They're like, what's going on? But they missed it. That's what I hate. It's a bad time of year. Uh, oh, another question. Uh, uh, what time will you uh, ride the box nose before the hangout start? One more time. Uh, when will you uh, ride the uh, box nose one before the class start? I, I I usually I try to write my box note five minutes before I try. Oh, okay, okay. Um, the the and. The reason is the GoToMeeting link, we have to start the link to give you uh, the, uh, uh, the link. So we, we can't pre-make, I guess you actually can pre-make a link. I've never done it. Uh, so what I do is uh, I just create the GoToMeeting and then I copy the link and I give it to you guys, usually about five minutes before I try to. Yeah, okay. Sorry, I got to truck coming in my property. I'm wondering what the hell's going on. Okay. Uh, go for it, Jack. Okay. <laughs> Martin, a clownfish, is a widower who has only his son Nemo left after a predator attack took his beloved wife. Years later, on Nemo's first day of school, the boy is captured by a scuba diver and ends up living temporarily in a dentist's office's fish tank. Martin and his new absent-minded friend, Dory, set off across the ocean to find Nemo and bring him home. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates scheme on how to get out of the tank before he becomes the dentist's new pet. Time takes quickly in this rescue adventure. Very nice job. Great job. Very pleased. And the speed is really good. The speed is really good. Uh, Jack, uh, let's start at the top here. I think uh, we had a problem with the owl before, too. Clownfish. Clownfish. So let's, I want you to compare... Try that. Clone. Clown. Clone or clown? Clone and clown. Good. Tone, town. Tone, town. Yeah, that was good. Let's do that again. Tone, town. Tone, town. Good. So you can see my mouth, right? Can you see me? Yeah. Yeah. So tone, town. Very different. Once again, tone, town. Tone, town. Good. Clone, clown. Clone, clown. Tone, town. Tone, town. Town, clown. Clone, <laughs> clone, clown. Terrible. Listen, listen, Jack. Listen to me. Town clown. So, yeah, the video uh, is not moving. Oh, it's frozen. Okay. So ignore my face. 
Town Clown. 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 <laughs> Sorry. Clown. <laughs> Clown. Uh, uh. Clown. All right, man. So let's let's start over. Are you, are you with me? Say say one, two, three. Okay. 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 Right, right, here we go. Town. Town. Clown. Clown. Better. Let's do it again. Ow. 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 Town. Town. Clown. Clown. You're having a really hard time. Uh, I'm recording <laughs> this, uh, and it's about at the 90-minute period. So I want you to come back and listen to this section, okay? Okay. All right, let's, let's skip it. Let's go here. So we're going to get rid of the D here and end. I'm going to I'm going to cancel the D. And ends up living. And ends up living. And ends up living. And ends up living. This is the same. So these two words are going to sound the same. And then. And then. And then. Good. Let's go here. By a scuba diver and ends up living. By a scuba diver and and ends up living. Good. So don't read. Just listen to me. Just shut your eyes. Listen to me. By a scuba diver and ends up living. By a scuba diver and ends up living. Sounds great. One more time. Shut your eyes. And ends up living. And ends up living. Good. Uh, say this word, these words, please. Thank you. Good. A little more. Thank you. Thank you. Smile. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Smile is the right pronunciation. Here too. Fish tank. Fish tank. Yes, yes. Tank mates. Tank mates. Not tank. Tank. You got to smile. Tank. 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 Tank mates. Yes. So, bank. 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 Gang. Gang. Yeah, it's all of these actually have a long A sound. A, A. And the long A is when we smile. A. So tank, thank, bank, gang, all the same, okay? Okay. Smile. Smile. Not smell. 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 Woo! Smile. Smile. Meanwhile. Meanwhile. <laughs> One more time. Meanwhile. Meanwhile. Good. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates. No. Meanwhile, diphthong. Meanwhile. Meanwhile. Nemo and his tank mates. Nemo and his tank mates. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates. Terrible. <laughs> Again. So, so uh, where's my uh, uh, my my so you're saying thought. you're saying meanwhile, meanwhile. And it's got to be meanwhile. Okay. Meanwhile. Again. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates. Tank mates. Tank mates. Again. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates. That was better. One more. Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates. Yes, that sounded very nice. <laughs> All right. Thank you. How do you say O N? Um. Yes. Um. Scheme on how to get out. Scheme on 
how to get to get out. Get out. Good. Niece's new pet. Don't leave out the S. Niece's new pet. Niece's niece's new pet. Rescue adventure. Rescue adventure. Ad adventure. So listen, adven. At when. Then. Then. Yeah, don't say when. Say then. Then. At then. At when. Rescue adventure. Rescue adventure. Yes. Rescue adventure. Yes, good job. Isn't it easy? No. No, but you're doing very well. You're doing a great job. Uh, but uh, uh, could you please show me how to pronounce out, uh, get out of, so it, it's, uh, uh, it's a silent T, get out of. So, okay, so remember everybody, perfect pronunciation, get out of, that's perfect, okay, and everybody should be able to do that. Get out of. Now, there's a lot happening here in daily English. First of all, out of is frequently, frequently spelt like this. Uh, but we don't say out of, we say out of. And we don't even say out of, we say out of. And the pronunciation for daily English is actually like out of. But remember, yeah. this, this is actually a flat T, not really a D. So try that. Ada. Ada. Ah, ah, ada. Ada. Good. Now, if we take the get and then we change this T to a flat T, we got, and I'm just going to go get a, get a, get a. Get a. Get a, get a. Get a. Good. Get out of. Get out of. That's right. So Nemo and his tank mate scheme on, excuse me, how to get out of, how to get out of. How to get out of. Yeah, we got a how to, how to get out of. How to get out of. How to get out of the tank. How to, how to get out of, how to get out of the tank. Good. How to get out of the tank. How to get out of the tank. How, how to get out of the, the tank. Really good. That was really good. <laughs> However, Jack, I don't want you to do that. But you did a great job. I prefer that you say on how to get out of the tank. I prefer stop sounds. On how to get out of the tank. So it's get out of. That's what I prefer. Uh, but we need to keep okay. it together. On how to get out of the tank. Okay. Try it. On how get out of, to out get of. out of the tank. Try that. On how to get out of the tank. That's what I that's perfect. For perf, that's what I want to hear. Yeah, okay, I know. Great job. Thank you. You bet. All right, I think uh, I think Aruna was next, right, Aruna? Yep. All right, Aruna, which one do you want to do? Um, 109. Yeah, same thing. 119. 119, yeah. <laughs> Let me close it and reopen it. Don't say. All right, let's change the screen. Get rid of me. Okay, Aruna, go for it. Marlin, a clownfish, is a widower who has only son Nemo, left after a predator attack, took his beloved wife. Years later, in Nemo's first day of school, the boy is captured by a scuba diver and ends up living temporarily in a dentist office's fish tank. Marlin and his new absent-minded friend Dory set off across the ocean to find Nemo and bring him home. 
Meanwhile, Nemo and his tank mates came on how to rid of the tank before he becomes the dentist's niece's new pet. Time ticks quickly in this rescue adventure. Wow, that was, Arun, I'm really happy. Uh, your R pronunciation got so much better. Really excellent job. Very, very pleased. Thank you. I'm going to get you mostly on a little, well, nothing too serious. Let's go back here. Um, a clownfish is possible, but more commonly a clownfish. A clownfish. A clownfish. Good. And a, 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 like U-H, a, a clownfish. A, a clownfish. Yes. Marlin, a clownfish. Marlin, a clownfish. Great job. Widower. Widower. Yeah. Watch my lips. Can you see me? Yep. Widower. Widower. Good. Widower. Widower. Very good. Were. Were. Yes. Were. Okay. yes. Uh -huh. Try again. Widower. Good. Very good. Very tough, but you did nice. Is a widower who has only his son. Is a widower who has only his son. Good. Has only his son. Has only his son. Only. Only. Yeah, don't make a W there. On. Let's, so. Oof, yeah. Only. Mm -hmm. Oh, only. Only. Um, try this. Oh. 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 Only. Ma no, no, no. Keep, I want you to have a, a sharper. Oh. 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 Good. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Good. On, on, on. On, on, on. On. So keep the, let's go back to the oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Good. And oh. there's no teeth, right? No teeth. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. On, on, on. On, on, on. Good. So there's still no teeth. Make sure you don't see teeth. Only. Only. Very nice, very Only. nice. Okay. Uh, ba -bum, ba -bum. On Nemo's first day. On Nemo's first day. First day. First day. Now that was really nice. Let's do this. Uh, on her first birthday. On her first birthday. Birthday. So all of these sounds, Aruna, need to sound the same. Er, er, er. On her first birthday. On her first birthday. Not too bad. One more time. Let's do er, er, er. Er, 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 er. Her fur. Her fur. Fur, burr. Fur, burr. On her first birthday. On her first birthday. It sounds better. It needs practice, but we'll get there, okay? Okay. Temporarily. Temporarily. Great job. Rarely. Rarely. Good. That was I liked it. Rarely. Rarely. Yes, Sorry? yes. So it's like rare, 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 r, 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 r. That's watch me, r, r. Perfect, Lee, Lee. Rare, r, Lee. Rare, r, Lee. Good, good. Rarely. Rarely. That was really good. So take your time. Temporarily. Temporarily. It sounds better. Very. It, and this is a really tough word. Tank. Tank. Thank you. Thank you. Tank mates. 
tank made? Tank. Tank. Thank you. Thank you. Tank mates. Tank tank mates. Yes, yes. One more time. Tank mates. Tank mates. Yes, exactly. Good job. Let's do this one again on how to get out of the tank. On how to get out of the tank. So let's break it again. On how to get out of the tank. On how to get out of the tank. Sounds much better. So let's do this. Uh, yeah. Nemo and his tank mate scheme on how to get out of the tank. Nemo and his tank mates scheme on how to get out of sorry to get out of the tank. Great job, very good. Just keep practicing, okay? Okay. You don't have to practice this, don't worry. Every week we have something new. So so you can keep going on, okay? Yeah, thanks. Rescue. Rescue. In this rescue adventure. In this rescue adventure. Sounds great. Adventure, perfect. Great job. Super. Questions? Actually, I have a still problem with the DR sound. Drink, drizzle. So it's a... All right. Uh, I'm just trying to think of dr words. D dress dress. Okay, good. Drake dress and what else? Let's try this. Drink this drizzle in the dress, Drake. Drink this drizzle in the dress, Drake. <laughs> Let's do this in the dresser drawer. Thank you. Drink this drizzle in the dresser drawer, Drake. Drink this drizzle in the dresser dryer, Drake. That was actually pretty good, pretty good. So let's go real slow. Drink. Drink. Great. Drizzle. Drizzle. Perfect. Dresser. Dresser. Excellent. Drawer. Drawer. Yeah, this word, everybody, sounds the same as this word. Drawer. Floor. Drawer. Floor. Try it. Drawer. Floor. Drake. Drake. So you're doing perfect, Aruna. But now let's put it together. Drink this drizzle in the... Ah, I, I can't do it. Drink this drizzle in the dresser drawer, Drake. Drink this drizzle in the dresser drawer. Draw, Drake. <laughs> so your beginning was good. And then suddenly, draw Drake. <laughs> but not too bad, not too bad. So, if you want, I want you to practice this several times and then make a little MP3 and send it to me when you're confident, okay? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Yep. <laughs> All right. Uh, Mahmoud, you're it. Pablo took off. Mahmoud, what do you want to do? Nemo. Nemo. Everybody wants to find Nemo. We don't need to find him. Let him be. He wants to be free. He was fishnapped. <clears throat> All right, Mahmoud, go for it. Marlin, a clownfish, is a widower who has only his son Nemo left after a predator attack took his beloved wife. Years later, on Nemo's first day of school, the boy is captured by a scuba diver and ends up living temporarily in a dentist office's fish tank. Marlin and his new absent-minded friend Dory set off across the ocean to find Nemo and bring him home. Meanwhile, 
Nemo and his tank mates came and had to get out of the tank before he becomes the dentist's niece's no pet. <laughs> ah, time ticks quickly in this rescue adventure. <laughs> Wonderful. Excellent job. I loved it. That was really great. Um... Uh, yeah, excellent, excellent job. And by the way, everybody, if you go to the practice folder in Perf, and if you see a very nice PDF file that tells you about the pronunciation and the meaning, uh, this is the Mahmoud who creates those. Excellent, excellent work. Thank you so much, Mahmoud. Uh, Thank you. Let's go back here. The boy is captured by a scuba diver. The boy is captured by a scuba diver. Yeah, no problem. Uh, off. Get that A-W. Set off across the ocean. Set off across the ocean. Yep. So these two sounds should be the same. Set off across the ocean. Set off across the ocean. Tank mates. Tank or tank. Tank. Tank mates. Tank mates. Oh, uh, okay. tank mates. Yes, yes. This, these are also the same. A A. Tank mates. They're actually the same. Tank mates. Tank mates. Thanks, tank mate. <laughs> Thanks, tank mates. Uh, you be white and I will be yellow. Go ahead. Let's go to the bank, tank mates. Try again. Tank mate. try, try again. Let's go to the bank, tank mate. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> bank, tank mate, thanks. Thanks. Bank, tank mate. Thanks. Bank, tank mate, thanks. Shukran. Afwan. What? <laughs> <laughs> My Arabic is very poco. <laughs> Super job, everybody. My goodness. Some of you are tough. We've been here the whole time. Andre, I'm so impressed. Gustavo, Jay, Steve, then came Elena. After that, the late party. I think Aruna was next. Maybe Hiba, Jack, and Mahmoud came after that. Thank you so much. I finished two coffees. This coffee is gone, and now I'm on my second coffee. Two hours? Oh, my God. That's incredible. I hope everybody enjoyed the Hangout. Any questions about anything? Thank you, Shane. My pleasure. Practice that song. Thank you. Absolutely. I downloaded it. <laughs> it's got the lyrics, so it should be uh, beneficial. Thank you. Bye, guys. Take care, everybody. Have a fantastic weekend. Uh, I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Thank you, Coach Chen. Thank you. Thank you, Coach. Have a nice day. Thank you, you too. Have a nice evening. Hey. Go ahead, Steve. I just shared you almost like a, like a joke. <laughs> you can tell your friend. Say, did you see the words U.S. Army Corps of Engineers? Yes. <laughs> we use a lot of this website, and also they have a lot of technical menus, um, foundation, geotechnic, geotechnical engineering work. Yep. So I always say, oh, okay, U U.S. <laughs> U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. <laughs> Until 
Last week, my colleague, he's a senior, he's my mentor in the office. We are very close, and he keeps smiling. I said, why, why you are start, uh, why, why you keep start smiling? He said, I can let you keep telling this word a hundred times, but do you mind I crack it? I said, yeah, go ahead, because uh, I, that's what I, I always want to learn from you. See, you should see U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. Cops, that, that means dead body. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I, I, I'll give you another one. You know now, but what about this one? There you go. Marine Corps soldier. There you soldier. go. Don't say Marine Corps soldier. I don't know. <laughs> it's going to be very mad. <laughs> oh, that's great. That's a, your, your mentor needs to be quicker to help you. <laughs> He he's because uh, he's because uh, he grew up here. No, he's from Ireland. They want they don't want to let people offend it. Yeah. No, you yeah. yeah that's right. That's why I really appreciate your help here. Oh, my pleasure. Great. You're doing great. You're doing excellent. And you know what? Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's it's because you work hard. That's what it is. So I I just I I appreciate that. Yeah, I, I try, try my, and, and also I, I just uh, try to share some good news with you. I feel, now I feel very com confident when I speak. At least I know if I want to speak what's the perfect English, I know where to get the source, all those kind of things. Yeah. And the next week, I'm going to go to University of Alberta, give graduate student a uh, talk about wow. the project. Yeah, that's, uh, and uh, two months, I. To, I think I shared it with you about uh, the talk I gave the geotennis cell in Edmond. It, it was a great success, and every people uh, was impressed, and they want me to upload my PowerPoint to the website. And uh, and uh, in October, I'm going to go to Ottawa, give another talk uh, for the Canadian geotennis Society. That's fantastic. I'm so proud. I'm so happy for you. That's great. Yeah, yeah. yeah my, my daughter always says, yeah, you should share with your coach about all this, your, your progress. I say, yeah, I always keep, keep updating him. And, uh, and uh, I just, just want to see. I really, really appreciate your help. Because I try to many different uh, English courses. This, uh, let's, let's master the English is the only one. It's kind of much, much above my expectation. Yeah, that makes me really happy, Steve. And I, and once again, I love to hear about the your achievements and progress. Uh, it makes me really proud. Congratulations. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's it's in there. I just shared. I probably at the end there for this year, I'll become the partner of the company. It's all because of my program. That's they, amazing. Yeah, five years or two years ago. They will say, okay, the only thing hold you back is your English. If you can get improved, you are there. And uh, just two weeks ago, and my the manager, he called me to his office and said, yeah, there's a manager from the whole can uh, Canada. They, have, they had a meeting in Edmonton. He said, you should say hi to all these uh, big guys. Cause we're going to uh, un uh, bring your name to the board. To have discussion about your this is your final that that that's probably the they call the stop so that that's that's the highest you can go that's your company wow so yeah and uh, of course I yeah <laughs> of course I shared shared with you last year in October they are, they kind of appointed me as a reviewer engineer yeah that that, that that's kind of a, Great achievement for me. Anyway, I'm uh, second uh, English or second second language, and now I'm review a lot of native people's writing. And uh, when I go out to the meeting, I'm going to make sure they speak properly. And uh, it's all because of you. I, 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 that's, yeah, yeah. I, I tried my best, but if without uh, let's master English, I don't think I can achieve that. Having a coach is really important. That's right. It is, it is, yeah. Especially a good coach, I've seen that. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks so much, Steve.
Yeah, I really appreciate it. And hopefully someday you can visit us in uh, the Rockies. We can go to the mountains, enjoy the great view. I, I, I tell you what, um, I absolutely will be visiting Canada. There are some places I want to go. And you live, uh, Alberta happens to be the province that has the most beautiful places. It is, yeah, it's especially in uh, every city I would say. In winter, I, I probably I uploaded some pictures I took in uh, Lake Louise and uh, some peaks and uh, ski. And uh, in summer, that's probably the best scene. Summer is the best, always the best scene, my favorite. Play golf and, uh, yeah. Yeah. I, I, should, I should let you go because you still have some more courses. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much, Steve. You have a fantastic Thank weekend. Thanks. You too. Take care. Bye. Okay.